for Nelius Dorsey. Now, you found him. That old bastard Saul sent you. It wasn't the Patriarch that brought us here. It was me. I'm Lucia Wesson, and I'm here for vengeance. For justice, for what you did to my family. Wesson? <laughs> I thought the Reed Boy took you all to the Garden of the Gods. I mean, go right ahead and kill me. <sighs> One way or the other, I know I'm dying today. And you should know that old Percival bro What? But... He would never... Even if that's true... It was never about you, little Wesson. It was about hurting your father. He destroyed the innocents in my family because he didn't like what I had to say. Turnabout's fair play, I guess. We fled to the plains. And to figure out how we fought. And we scrapped. And we starved. When the Patriarch exiled Liberty, let me tell you something. Those gangs are living on a knife's edge of starvation. They hate everything. My sons and I planned it. Word came, didn't know much about you. But I did know I couldn't let aid. Liberty said I was moving too soon and told me to wait. I thought she was being too cautious. Figured I'd get the revolution started on my own. Take out you. Yeah. We could have, but we didn't. Speaking of people dying, I reckon you killed my son, Jared. What about my other son, Erastus? I haven't heard any word from him. Do you know what happened to him? Maybe he'll find his way to a better life. He deserves more than the one I gave him. Good. The last thing you're going to see is a Wesson pulling a trigger on your worthless hide. Do I have to do everything myself? No wonder this revolution's off to such a shitty start. You think it's true? What he said? That my daddy murdered the Dorseys just for wanting elections? We should find my father. We can ask him. He'll tell me the truth. Come on. Our work here is done.
Hold your ground.
Corporal Riley Woodson, Team November, out of Arizona, broadcasting on all Desert Ranger channels. Does anyone read me? Yes, he's my brother. So, you are with the Desert Rangers? Okay, listen up. I don't have much time here. Big Lee Cannon, the Patriarch's crazy ass son, is holding me and my team captive. <laughs> we got lucky, I guess. The attack broke up the ice, forced us into. Guess that part worked out at least. Hell yeah. Badly. Don't worry about it. We don't have much time here. It's. It's bad up here. Worse than you. Vic and his people are insane. Remember that. Under. And I'm not exaggerating when I call his people insane. Breathers. Nearly everyone up here will kill you on sight. So take it slow. Good to hear that. My guards coming back. See you soon, Rangers. What's it now? On your guard. Some strange folks ahead.
told you to call on me. Gosh darn great to meet you. We're rolling out the red carpet for you. You're here. I thought I... name's Opie. I've been hiding in there since Vic and his crazies rolled like, like, like breathing, slow and steady. With it's good to hear that. <laughs> Not like you bunch. You're the Rangers, ain't you? I've been hearing about you. You know. Hey, buddy. Welcome back. You here to talk? Uh, I guess that's over now. Well, so that was before anyway. Everyone who... of the hundred families use it. The bridge outside leads to the gun. Uh, not much. No. Oh, sure, buddy. Yeah, here you go. Hey, buddy. Welcome back. You here to talk? Oh, sure, buddy. Yeah, here you go. Hey, buddy. Welcome back. You oh, sure, buddy. Yeah, here you go. Sounds like a fucking war zone out there. I don't know what the fuck I'm gonna do. 
I locked myself in the back room with most of my gear, but I lost my damn glasses out in the snow. I, I just gotta lay low and hope nobody comes looking. Been about 24 hours since the attack, I guess. Didn't get much sleep. Hey, buddy. Welcome back. You here to talk or trade? Absolutely.
here. Need an antidote. 